So a couple of things this morning. Had some fun yesterday on the way to work. I heard a thump a little bit and it was actually hit the right rear. And then about five miles later, that happened. So, so much for that. These tires were getting kind of old, but they weren't ready to be replaced yet, but now they will be. And I thought I was going to put the tires off of the Expedition on the truck, but I looked at it, and I guess when uh, at that era they went to six lug wheels, because it's got exactly the same size wheels and tires on it. They just happen to be six lugs, so I can't do that. But I found a few other things out about this thing today. Uh, dropped the spare, which I thought was a new one, but it isn't. It is a completely unused... I mean, this thing has all of the little flashing on it. Completely unused, 16-year-old Continental. <laughs> it has a build, uh, a manufacturing date of 02. And looking at this wheel, you can see some of what else I found. The, uh, undercarriage is not terrible it's salvageable the frame has got a lot of thick scale on it kind of like it was undercoated almost it's coming off in flakes like this but it's solid underneath and uh, I, I can work with that I'm gonna seal that up and I think that'll be all right but I did after getting into it find that it's quite a bit rustier than I had hoped. Well, hope was a word because I know better with these things. Cars coming from up north, it's uh, it, it, it just is what it is. And basically I was banging around and I bumped the rocker panel underneath the door. And she's gone. I mean, this whole area. Is pretty much junk. <clears throat> so I have a decision to make, and I also found a, a hole up in this area here under the floor. That's, uh, I mean, it's repairable. So I seriously considered parting this thing out, but. This kind of repair isn't terribly expensive. I've done it before on an old Jeep. Um, and, you know, I don't need this truck to be a showpiece. I just need it to be solid. And everything else is pretty good. Drivetrain's good. Interior's really good. Um, but, you know, this was, this was unfortunate. But I, you know, I know that this is this is what happens when stuff lives up north. There's just nothing you're going to do about it. Um, but, so I just ordered some repair panels. I mean, it's basically solid right above this, this bump here. It's solid above that. Let's see what I'm going to need to do. Obviously, these running boards are going to have to come off. And maybe I'll start working on that today to see how big of a disaster that turns into and what else I find. But we're going to start investigating and see what we're going to have to do to make this thing reasonable, reasonably livable for the next... You know, if I can get five years out of it, I'll be pretty darn happy. So that's a quick update. But yeah, it is what it is, I guess now... If nothing else, I get to buy some tools because I haven't had a flanger or anything else. I've just always kind of hacked it. But I want to try to make this look a little decent. So, that's where we're at.